News 4's Austin Brissett on the night beat. And Austin, he now faces 90 years in prison. Yeah, Kevin, and it's all coming due to breaking into storage units. He allegedly hit two companies in Yukon between June 19th and July 6th, ripping the doors off their tracks, causing around $2,000 in damage to each of them. But those wouldn't be his only two places. It really shook me up, made me feel angry that someone would do that to us. Martha Crawford, owning one of 10 storage units, allegedly hit by 36-year-old Joseph Tucker near I-40 and Mustang Road. It just feels like you're violating, you know, and people go in there and take your stuff. But that's not the only theft case Tucker is being linked to. According to investigators, Tucker allegedly hit 67 other units in Yukon. The case was cracked when it was all caught on camera. Court documents showing police found multiple items like jewelry, wine bottles, baseball cards, and coins inside Tucker's Main Street apartment. We had like some sentimental stuff, maybe Christmas things, ornaments, um, just in some sort of like decorations. Martha still trying to figure out exactly what was taken, saying they may have even had bank information inside. It's frustrating because I'm talking to my mom about. Well, was that in there or was that not in there? Is it just missing that missing? Adding that she hasn't even gotten all of her items back yet. It makes you wonder where it is. Well, Martha says she's considering taking all of her stuff out of the unit after what happened. Tucker is facing 10 counts of second degree burglary and 10 counts of malicious injury to property, plus any charges that may come from the previous 67 break ins.